hello you guys this is nikita welcome to my channel today i'm going to create new york glam look so i'm using this setup moisturizer for moisturizing my face before makeup this moisturizer is best for acne prone skin after that i'm using this requel sunscreen in order to protect my skin from uv rays so this is the best sunscreen i would recommend to all the dry skin people so here i'm moisturizing my lips using this the face shop lip balm this lip cream is hydrating and long lasting so this is my skin after moisturizing and say hello to my pimples now I am prepping my skin using this MAC Prep Plus Prime Setting Spray. After that, I am gonna set the primer water using this Soft Beauty Blender by Pack. So I am using this concealer by Maybelline uh, in the shade Caramel in order to conceal the pigmentation around my eyes, mouth and on my face. Now I'm blending the concealer using same beauty blender. Now I'm mixing two foundation by Maybelline Fit Me in the shade 310 and Maybelline Superstay in the shade 334 to get my perfect skin color. Now you can see that I'm taking this foundation in small quantity and applying on the center of my cheeks, on my chin and on my forehead area and blending it with using the same pack beauty blender. Always make sure that you are blending the foundation in tap motion so that it will not disturb the base and it will avoid any kind of cakiness on the face. Here I'm using this loose powder by Maybelline Fit Me to set my base. First I'll set my under eyes and then we'll set all the face. Now I'm setting my face using the same loose powder using this big buff powder brush. I'm also setting the eye area in order to avoid any crease formation. Now my eyes are all set and I'm using this bronzer by Sugar as an eyeshadow in order to give that deep crease effect. So pigmentation on my eyes are quite prominent so it can be seen after concealing but you can avoid this by using uh, the color correctors. In this video I am going to create green smoke eye effect so I am taking this uh, deep brown color as a base eyeshadow color. By the way I am using this eyeshadow palette by Aromas and Canby and this palette is a dupe for the Huda Beauty the new nude eyeshadow palette. Uh, colors in this palette are very well pigmented also i am applying the same color on lower lash line in order to give that smoke out effect here i am taking uh, round eyeshadow blending brush to blend uh, all the edges uniformly I'm using this green coal by Blue Heaven. First, I'll apply this uh, green kajal on the inner side of upper eyelid. Then I'm applying all over the eyelid. Repeating the same procedure on the lower eyelid. Also, I am giving here uh, the small wing like effect. Here, I 
here i'm taking this flat eyeshadow brush and using this i'm uh, smudging out this kajal in order to give it a smoky effect also here i'm trying to draw this uh, the not most precise uh, wing but it's just a smoky wing Now I am finishing out this eye look using this Maybelline Hyper Curl Mascara. This mascara adds volume to the eyelashes and gives an illusion of a false lashes. This is how I am done with this eye look and you can see my eyes are looking simple yet so elegant. Now I am making my brows using the most precise brow pencil by NYX. So firstly I will uh, comb my brows in upward direction using spoolie. Now I am lining the edges of brows. After that I am filling in the brows in order to hide the scarcity of uh, hairs. Again, I am um, combing the brow using this pulley for uniform distribution of color so that it will not uh, look weird or uh, fake. In this way, uh, making brows could be the big game changer in your look. Now I am using this uh, lip and cheek tint by the face shop as a blush. Also make sure uh, you are applying it in small quantity so that it will not create any kind of mess. And also uh, blend it as soon as uh, the application so that uh, it will be easy to blend. I am so sorry I have lost the footage for blush application. Now I am using this highlighter by Maybelline Master Chrome uh, to highlight the higher points of my face. Also I am highlighting the brow bone area. So here I am using this big brush in order to blend the edges of blush and highlighter uniformly. Also I am highlighting the inner corners of my eyes using this small brush so that it will open up my eyes. Also highlighting the higher points of my nose. I don't like to apply the chunk of highlighter on my bridge of nose so I'm just highlighting these two points for my lips I'm using this lip pencil by K beauty this is the beautiful brown color though I don't like the formulation of this pencil as you have seen that I have added color to my eyes so here I'm going with the nude lips so I'm using this lipstick by Maybelline in the shade Nude Neons. This is such a beautiful nude color for all these skin tones. This is my final look for the new year party. This look is so subtle yet so glamorous. I hope you have enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel for more such beautiful videos. Please comment down below if you want to give me any kind of uh, suggestion as this is my first YouTube video. So bye bye, take care.